Um, hello guys. Um, today we're going to learn how to set up our Facebook instant articles for our blog. So to get started, we need to install um a plugin called Instant Article WP plugin. So let's just go ahead and search then install our plugin. So search for Facebook Instant Article. So in a search result, we'll yeah we need to install this. It's called Instant Articles for WP by Automatic Decode and Facebook. So let's go ahead and install that. Um. Then let's activate the plugin. So after activation, we should have it in our side menu. So let's just select that. So before we continue, we need to set up um, our Facebook app. We need to create a Facebook app. So as to be able to set it up, we need our app ID and app secret. So to do that, let's go ahead to developers.facebook.com forward slash apps to create our app so we need to create a new app for our blog for this tutorial so we'll select the website let's add the name of the app call this the city of Lagos let's go ahead and create the app set category Okay, news. Then set put an email address. Hello at ct of Lagos com. Okay, um, we good. Create app. Okay, for the authentication purposes, please select all photos with which shows a wristwatch. This does, this does, and this does. Submit. So I think we're good. We have our app. Let's just add a URL. GP. Next. So once we have that, just go to the top and click this button skip start st skip quick start then we have our app id and our app secrets so let's just go ahead and copy this come here you paste it let's get our get our app secret and then our password So these are app secret. Let's copy that to paste it here. Then we hit the next button. Okay, we have that. So before we continue, we need to make our app live. To do that, let's come down to app review. You hit this, confirm. Then our app is live. We'll go back to settings. We need to add, okay, we have already have the URL here. We need to copy this and add it to app domain. Okay. 
save options so we have that set up the next thing we need to connect this to our Facebook page we log in with Facebook the domain of this URL is included oh I think we need to fix this um, let's just reload this so we have our current okay let's get back here we need to edit this just copy this paste save so let's go ahead and try this again yeah we're good so we you hit ok button ok so now we're going to select the page we can see the page is not included here because we have not set up instance article for the page so let's go back to our page book facebook um, page on that publishing tool um, we can see we don't have instant article here we hit sign up for instant article here so we need to select the page check this box then access instant article now you have access to publishing to hit continue so you can see we have our instant article here so let's just go ahead to configure that we we'll need to claim our URL we need to copy this and put it somewhere on our website on the head before between the head tag between the head tag so we need to copy this let's go to appearance editor then team select I'm actually using its child theme for this so I selected the parent team so we are going to locate the header dot php okay I think there's it then we we'll paste the tag between the head tag so let's put it somewhere here let's paste that so we have it here let's go ahead and update this So we have that here. Let's go back to our Facebook page. Then we add our URL. So you claim URL. Yeah, we are. We have that. I think we're good. Next, we need to add our production RSS feeds feeds I think we need to do this H T T P dot slash www dot e c t of gash dot com and forward slash feed forward slash instant <laughs> hyphen articles before we do go ahead let's just check to see if this works so we can see we have our feeds so that works let's just copy that then save that hit ok
so having that let's go back to our site under instant articles let's log in with Facebook again so now we have a page here so we'll select this then hit next so having this set up we go back to our page now we will need to submit for review but before we can submit for review we must create 10 articles so instead of creating 10 articles here there's um, a short way we could do that a faster way we need to go back to our dashboard and go under all posts what we need is to open each post let's open 10 posts in a new tab edit mode Okay, what we need to do is just to update we have one update the second the third the fourth the fifth the sixth so we need four more to go so this is done close that so let's just go ahead and add four more to it one two three four so it done this, done this, done this, done this, done this. So let's just go ahead and wait then update the remaining four before we continue. So we update this, update this, update this, then update this. This is done. This is done. This is done. This is done. So let's just go back and reload our page. Let's check on our configuration. Um still not we still don't have this here um, what are we doing wrong um, we have this this is right um, what can be the problem oh I think um, the problem is our uh, URL if we can check our app URL I think let's check on the settings okay we don't have the www dot so let's just go ahead and add that to this without the www Let's just go ahead and claim that. Okay, I think we have that done. Let's go back to our post. Now let's edit this. Um, 
let's just update this so once that is done let's check our production article we still have none here let's just go below to see um, okay you can see the article was submitted to instant article successfully so let's go ahead and do that for the remaining nine posts indeed it so we are going to do this for 10 different posts just update 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 so we have this let's just close this and close this so we've done four let's do six more date date update date okay close 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 so we have eight two months ago update update so we update this and then update this I think now we have a 10 post let's just go ahead and reload the page so you can see we have a post here and published so let's go back to configuration now we have a missing logo so we are going to create um, a logo for our page under styles you hit default so we need um a 690 by 132 pixel logo so i've created mine which i'm going to upload so i have it here so i have the logo so i'm going to save this so I can close this and I'll go ahead and hit refresh so now we can submit for review this will take between three to five business days to get feedback from Facebook so I think we are done here thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.